So the first thing I want to determine is whether this new numbness or paresthesias is representing a new relapse or it could be a pseudo relapse. If it's a new relapse, then the issue will come up whether we wish to use steroids as an acute treatment to speed up the time frame of recovery or not. And that will be a dialogue with the patient that we will come to that. If I think it's a pseudo relapse, then I want to identify any precipitating infection and if there's specific treatment, I want to do that. I want to control and increase in temperature. Um, if the numbness or paresthesias are, re are remaining and are looking like they're going to be a more extended problem, then I would really dialogue with the patient very carefully. The first issue is how bothersome is the abnormal sensation. Mm -hmm. It's not reaching the level of pain. I think when you have pain, it's very clear that that is a quality of life issue that needs to be treated. The patient is suffering. With things like pins and needles or numbness, sometimes the more the patient focuses on it, the more they actually enhance it, they're, uh, they're increasing their awareness of it, the more they can kind of put it out of their mind or tend to neglect it or try not to think about it, actually the less it becomes. So I actually have a dialogue to see whether it's significant enough that the patient wants to go on a daily medication to blunt it or not. And frequently they'll say, no, if you tell me I don't have to worry about it and it's probably going to go away, I'll just give it more time.